Hi everyone, my name is Nick Pavlov and I welcome you to our YouTube channel. At Sintida, we combine business consulting with advanced analytics. Our goal is simple. We help our clients to turn complex data into clear and actionable insights. Today, I'm excited to talk about something that's been a big topic in the Power BI community. Microsoft Fabric is now generally available. We have been exploring what Microsoft Fabric is, what it offers, and why we think it's something special. So in the next videos, we will learn about Fabric from its friendly interface to its powerful analytical tools and how Fabric could improve your company's data management processes. That being said, if you're interested in Fabric and Power BI, please join our channel. To kick things off, our first video will give you an introduction to Microsoft Fabric, what it is and why it is a big deal. So now let's go to my computer screen and talk about Fabric. In this video, we're going to cover four main questions. What is Microsoft Fabric? Uh, components of Microsoft Fabric. And then we're gonna talk about one lake and why it is important. And then lastly, we are gonna talk about the benefits of Microsoft Fabric. Microsoft Fabric is your one-stop cloud solution for data analytics and data management. Fabric combines everything from data storage, data integration, data science, and analytic services into a single platform. In this day and age, businesses cannot afford delays when storing data, when processing it, or analyzing it. Microsoft Fabric offers a unified platform that improves the entire analytics lifecycle, from data storage, from transformation, analysis, and reporting. And all of that happens under one robust security umbrella. This kind of unification allows for quicker and more convenient decision making. With the introduction of Fabric, Microsoft wants you to move from old system where data is fragmented and scattered everywhere across multiple places, which is difficult to manage, it is expensive, and poses certain security risks. I think that the word revolutionize is overused these days. However, when it comes to Microsoft Fabric, it actually may not be. Fabric aims to shift the paradigm from a patchwork of isolated systems to one cohesive cloud-native ecosystem. Let's talk about the components of Fabric. Microsoft Fabric is like a Swiss army knife for handling data and analytics. and brings many powerful tools under one roof. Let's break down these main components. If we go from left to right, we have Power BI. Power BI is your main reporting tool. It visualizes and analyzes your data to make it easier to understand. Power BI provides an intuitive and easy way to access Fabric data. Many of you have already used Power BI in the past. It's an exceptional BI tool in and of itself, and now it is part of Microsoft Fabric. Next is Data Factory. Data Factory serves as your main ETL tool and can handle comprehensive data integration tasks. Data Factory offers more than 200 connectors for data connection from various sources. It is capable of transforming billions of rows and is optimized for both batch and real-time data processing. All of this makes Data Factory perfect for robust data integration and pipeline orchestration. Then we have Data Engineering and Data Warehouse. These tools are your main data architects. They can design and store your data effectively. The data engineering component provides the infrastructure for data management, while Data Warehouse is your storage solution for structured enterprise data. So in short, these two components provide scalability of storage and computing, allowing for better performance and management. Then we have data science component which focuses on the creation and the use of machine learning models, and then further integrating them into your analytics. Data science interacts with Azure machine learning and enables data analysts to include predictive capabilities in their business intelligence reports. Real-time analytics helps to capture and analyze streaming data for real-time analytics and decision-making. This is a dedicated infrastructure for streaming data from IoT devices. Many think this is one of the most important and fast-growing data categories, which include real-time interactions, application data, and more. And then we have Data Activator. Data Activator component automates actions based on data triggers. This tool can run queries 
if and when certain conditions in a data set are met, this helps to close the loop from insights to action, enabling more dynamic decision making. And now one leg. As you can see in this picture, all these components are built on top of one leg, which is the unified data lake for all computing services. One lake simplifies storage architecture and data accessibility for all other fabric components. Everything is now stored in one place. We at Cintida have come to call this one lake for one truth, because all of your data is in one place and therefore it is the ultimate source of single truth. One lake is a unified data lake that stores both structured and unstructured data. It serves as the foundation for all the computing services in Fabric. So essentially, one lake is a huge storage for data, like a digital lake where you can put all sorts of data, whether it's emails, spreadsheets, videos, social media data, doesn't matter. Now imagine you run a retail business with multiple stores. You have sales in spreadsheets, you know, you have customer feedback in emails and inventory levels in a separate database. Instead of keeping this information scattered in different places, you can store everything in one lake. This makes it easier to manage and analyze the data. The key thing about one lake is that you only need to have one lake for your entire organization, regardless of how many locations and regions you operate in. You don't need separate lakes for North America, South America, Asia, whatever. One one lake will serve that purpose. In the context of big data analytics, the format of your data can impact your operations. Traditional row-based formats like CSV and Excel are not best for large analytical queries because they have to read an entire row, even if a few columns are needed. One lake uses the Delta Parquet format, which is column-based, and is designed for quick and efficient reading of large volumes of data. And that makes one lake really, really effective when working with big data. A lake house is built on top of one lake. The lake house has features of both data lake and a data warehouse. You can store any type of data, like it's a lake. You also can get the high performance and analytical capabilities of a data warehouse. Going back to our previous retail example, Let's say you want to analyze last year's sales data to predict which items will be popular next Christmas. In a lake house, not only all of that sales data is available and stored, but it's also organized and ready for complex analysis. So you can easily dive into that data and pull out the insights that you need. Lastly, let's talk about why Fabric is such a big deal. Uh, this is not the full list of benefits that Microsoft Fabric has, but rather, you know, five most important things that I wanted to point out. Number one is simplification of processes and tools. So having all these components under one umbrella simplifies the complexities often associated with dealing with multiple tools and services. Number two is integration. The integration is not just superficial, it is deep and meaningful. Microsoft invested two years in making sure all of these services work seamlessly together. Next is collaboration. Microsoft Fabric enables better collaboration among data engineers, data scientists, and data analysts. Everyone can work in similar environment, which helps to focus more on the project's success rather than on getting different products to work together. Four is universal application. The unified platform means that policies, permissions, and data sensitivity labels can be universally applied, streamlining governance and compliance. And lastly, number five is time and cost efficiency. Having an all-in-one solution reduces the time and cost associated with moving data between different platforms and tools. I put likely cost in brackets because Microsoft Fabric is not yet generally available, so I don't have the actual information to tell you on how much it will exactly cost, but I do believe that it will save companies money too. This was a short introduction to Microsoft Fabric and its components. We believe that this platform has a huge potential to change the world of analytics. That being said, let's continue getting to know Microsoft Fabric and in the next video, we will create a fabric workspace and start working with it.